Howdy guys, uh, welcome to your love reading for Leo. This is going to be for your July 2023. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. Uh, we're going to take a look and see what's going on with you guys in love and the person that you are connecting with for July. And then we'll take a look and see what your person's true feelings and intentions are towards you. And then we'll finish off the read with the outcome and advice. Um, and what else? Uh, so just apply this to your own unique situation. Switch the most if you want. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective Leo people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. So if you're looking for a reading that's tailored to your specific unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post and when I go live. Uh, what else? Um, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok and then Instagram, the links for those are in the description box below. Um, I do post readings on there too, okay? So Leo. Tell me about Leo here. Tell me about Leo. What's going on with Leo in love and the person that they are connecting with here for July 2023 for Leo? Tell me about Leo in love. Over energies for Leo regarding love and the person that they are connecting with for July 2023. Sun, moon, rising, Venus signs for Leo. The high priestess here and the six of wands. Whoever this individual is, I feel like this person is really attractive. I feel like this is a very confident individual, but I also feel like this person is very mysterious too. Yeah, I mean, this could be you. This could be you behaving this way, you know, towards somebody, okay? You know, I feel like someone here is definitely keeping things under wraps here, not sharing too much, just very mysterious here. You know, we have the Queen of Cups here, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, and Judgment here, Sagittarius energy. And then the Five of Swords and the Nine of Cups. You know, one of the things I'm getting here is that I feel like if this is you here, Leo, I just feel like you're really feeling good about yourself here. Yeah, you're feeling really good about yourself. You're putting yourself first. You're happy here. You know, I feel like you've made some big changes in your life. Um, I feel like the way that you approach love, I feel like it's different than it was in the past here, okay? So, I mean, is there anyone that you're dealing with here? I mean, we'll take a look, but it just seems like you're putting yourself first here, Leo. Yeah, you're putting yourself first here. Tell me about the High Priestess. We have the Four of Wands. Tell me about the Six of Wands here and the Four of Pentacles. One of the things I'm getting is that I feel like you're really hopeful. You're holding on to hope. Uh, that you you will find your person here or that you you will find a relationship that you want here you know i feel like i feel strongly that uh leo i feel like you could be manifesting the connection that you want right now okay tell me about the queen of cups here in the four of cups tell me about the uh judgment card and the devil here yeah so i feel like you've made a lot of changes here because i feel like in the past you've experienced relationships that were really really unhealthy here and i feel like you've made changes and, and done some work, uh, some healing work surrounding this so that you don't at attract this type of energy again, okay? So I feel like any sort of like toxic energies that you've dealt with before, like I feel like you're releasing it, okay? You know, I do feel like you guys might be doing energy work to clear out, you know, uh, any, any attachments that are still attached to you right now. Tell me about the Five of Swords here. We have the Death of card scorpio energy the nine of cups here and the knight of pentacles here capricorn towards virgo here there is someone else here someone here is finding you really attractive someone here is seeing you as your wish fulfillment here but like i said I, I just feel like you're you're being very mysterious i feel like you're not sharing too much you know um you know i feel like you're not, you're just not giving too much at the moment here because i just feel like you don't want to get hurt again or just or just that you don't want to get stuck in a bad situation again okay uh king of pentacles capricorn taurus virgo tell me about the person that leo's dealing with here what is this person's true feelings and intentions towards leo what is this person's true feelings and intentions towards leo for july 2023 sun moon rising venus signs for leo what is this person's true feelings and intentions towards leo what is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Leo here? We have temperance and the hangman. You know, I do feel like this person 
comes in peace. <laughs> yeah, like literally. Yeah, I, I do feel like this person does have something to offer here, something different than what you experienced in the past here. Temperance, Sagittarius energy, the hangman, Piscean energy. We have the moon card here and the fool. This person is just as mysterious as you, okay? I do feel like this is an individual that's kind of been through the same thing that you have been through, but I feel like this person is willing to take the risk to get to know you here. Like, I feel like this person is also conquering their fears here, you know, because I feel like they have the same worries as you do. Uh, the fool, Aries energy, Aquarius energy here. Let's see. We have a tower here in the Eight of Pentacles. I do feel like, you know, this individual also is still healing from a past situation here. Like it was like an abrupt end um, or, or, or it was a painful ending here. But I feel like also through what this person experienced here with the Tower and the Eight of Pentacles, this person is definitely working on fixing something here. You know, healing, fixing themselves here, working on, the set, on, on themselves. But like I said, with the Two of Cups here, you're, you're definitely meeting a soulmate here. Whoever this is, I feel like this is an individual that's willing to invest in you. Okay, and I, I, and I feel like this person's willing to tell you the truth about how they truly feel about you because I do feel like this person's in love with you. And I feel like it's really taking a lot of the, uh, 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 this person a lot of courage to come forward or to move forward here with you. Because I do feel like, like I said, both you guys might have been through some some similar experiences and you guys are going through an experience of healing right now. And I feel like both you guys will be able to support each other on your healing journey here. Okay, um, let's see, tell me the Eight of Pentacles here and the Lovers here, Gemini Energy. This is a divinely guided soulmate here. I feel like you, you're meeting this person for a reason here. I do feel like this is a new new person. I do feel like this is a new person here. Tell me about Leo, outcome and advice. What else does Leo need to know, look out for, work on here regarding their love situation for July 2023 for Leo? What else does Leo need to know, look out for, work on here, outcome and advice? Knight of Pentacles here and the Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, there will be a commitment here. There will be a commitment here with this individual. I do feel like this person is definitely really serious is about making something happen here with you uh we have the empress here and the knight of cups i mean this is an individual that's seen growth and expansion here with you this person sees you guys moving in together you know getting married having children okay whoever this is i do feel like this is an individual like i said is sincere and a genuine in, uh, 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 about wanting to build something here with you one wanting to you know support each other in your healing journeys here with the eight of wands here and the knight of wands i mean whoever this is i i feel like this person's definitely chasing you this individual is chasing you we have all we have we have every single knight that's out here i think yeah we have every single night we have four knights here you know, just, um, you know, one of the, my only concerns is that, you know, I do feel like this person's energy is a bit scattered here, but I also feel like they're grounded at the same time here. The Knight of Pentacles here and the uh, King of Swords, the Ace of Pentacles here and the world. Whatever this is, this is an individual that wants to give you the world. Yeah. I, I do feel like this person's a pretty good communicator. I do feel like this person's very honest about their intentions and their feelings here. The Empress and the Five of Pentacles, the Knight of Cups here and the Page of Swords. This is so interesting. I do feel like somehow, like, I feel like you make this person feel a little insecure here, okay? I do feel like this person's a little shy and a little bit coy around you, but I do feel like this person wants to learn everything about you here, okay? Tell me about the Eight of Wands here. We have the Six of Swords, the Knight of Wands here, and the uh, Seven of Swords. Wow. Just be careful here. I do feel like this person's do, do, willing to do what it takes to, you know, win you over even if they have to lie here, okay? Even if they have to lie here. But you know what? One of the things I'm getting here is that, Leo, you could be seeing some red flags here. Yeah, you could be seeing some red flags here. And I feel like you're really careful around this person, okay? You, you just rather kind of be alone and just kind of like figure it out and just see what happens than rush into it. So Leo, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I will speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks guys, bye.